had a, um, a bad situation in the park with my children recently. They were getting dizzy on a uh, on a roundabout uh, on a thing that you spin around. Right? And it occurred to me, oh, that might be the first time in the humans life where they have like an inebriating mind-altering effect is when they're getting dizzy yeah. in the park for the first time. Yeah. Just a yeah, uh, just a, just a silly observation. But Zoo, it's interesting when you look at like the way a brain lights up on LSD, for example, and all these different parts connecting, it actually looks exactly like how infant's brain lights up. Oh, really? Yeah. So it's almost like kids, like before their sense of self, like that, e the ego doesn't fully form until like seven, eight years of life. So children are yes. in this like open state and this sense of awe and, you know, they're more emotional. They're well, kind of like tripping that, all the time. Yeah. Yeah. No, that's, that's, that's just true because you, you, I never understood the term, uh, a child is naive until I had children. And that's exactly what you're describing. They don't mm -hmm. have an ego. They don't, Mm -hmm. know where to place themselves in the world they're mm -hmm. completely naive uh, mm -hmm. and innocent and open and yeah open and that is very interesting that, mm -hmm. that the two brains look they look similar. very similar in how they light up yeah do you see that happen the lighting up happening in older people let's say Anna. 70 plus 80 plus do their brains light up the way young yeah, children? They, they still if um on a psychedelic yes yeah. yes yeah yes. Yes. Yeah, they can be more sensitive and there can be more side effects and stuff, but there have been trials. Uh, there's a trial going on at ChemH for mild cognitive impairment using mm. psilocybin right now. So there's research happening. There's a trial at Johns Hopkins that was looking at like um, like the early phase of being diagnosed with Alzheimer's. It's a, often a time where there's a lot of depression, even suicidality. And so they're targeting psilocybin, mm. not so much for the cognitive aspect, but for the distress that comes yes. with that kind of diagnosis.